Um, I think it depends on what role that you come in to um, apply for. Um, obviously, if it's a solicitor's fee earning role, you'll need the qualifications for that specific role. If it's for a secretary role, then you'll need obviously experience of working in um, the previous solicitors with typing. Um, although we do have um, apprentices, so they haven't had any training at all. So we've obviously done the training with them and brought them on. We've had um, apprentices that have come on and they've gone on to be paralegals. So we do help them with the training um, going forward and to promote them in whatever they want to do. Um, you just send a CV with a covering letter to recruitment at hopkins-solicitors.co.uk um, which will come to me and uh, we'll get back to you with a response. And normally we get back to people within a week um, depending on how, ma how many applications that we've had in um, does depend on how long it takes us to get back to you but normally we get, we get back to them within a week. It depends obviously on what role that you're coming for. Um, if it's a fee earner role, then obviously it will be a partner or a head of department that will do the interview for that. If it's for a support role, then it will be myself or a head of department that will do it. It could take between one and two weeks before we get back to the person. Obviously we'll need to do pre-employment checks um, and also we'll um, need to find out whether they're able to work in the UK so we'll need ID such as driving licence, passport etc. Um, so on the first day uh, they'll come to the office that they'll be working at and uh, we'll do their induction. Um, which basically talks them through their policies and procedures and how the office works um, and then we'll give them training uh, for the rest of the day and obviously that will run for the rest of the week as well the training to get them up to speed with the systems that we've got in place and also to get them used to um, the office environment and um, the other members of staff that they'll be working with. Um, so the probationary period is normally three months. Um, so we offer 21 days holiday. Um, we also get an additional four days um, that the partners give us over the Christmas period for the uh, offices to close. Um, and we also get the opportunity to purchase holidays um, throughout the year as well. Um, so obviously we get the additional four days holiday, um, we get to purchase addition, additional holidays as well um, and we also have a workplace pension scheme. So standard office hours are half past eight till five o'clock, um, that's over all five of our offices. Um, with regard to flexible working, we do have flexible working here at Hopkins. Um, that obviously is on an individual basis um, at the discretion of the partners. Um, but there are quite a few people that do have flexible working, whether it's for childcare um, and also if they've got court hearings um, during the day, then obviously they can work from home as well if they need a quiet space.